Uh, growing up, uh, favorite idol probably would have been uh, a combination of Wayne Gretzky and uh, Steve Eiserman, and basically just because my uh, I just was kind of tagging along what my older brothers were were cheering for. So. In the world, um, I think it's got to be Sidney Crosby. Um, I think it pretty much speaks for itself. Um, you know, obviously the back-to-back -back Stanley Cups. Um, you know, the guy pretty much does it all. Um, it's pretty fun to watch too. So, um, I'd probably say just um, making making my way to the NHL. Uh, getting my first NHL game was probably. Uh, um, you know, probably my biggest moment for me um, as a player. You kind of grow up, uh, you know, kind of wanting and wanting and dreaming of uh, playing in the NHL. And um, you know, I went and uh, you know, and it uh, it happened for me. So it was a pretty exciting time for me. Um, not at all. Um, probably the opposite. Uh, I find it very strange that if people do have weird superstitions, but uh, for me, I'd say it's more just, again, routine, just I like things a certain way and tape my stick a certain way, but I'm not doing it because of any reason other, <laughs> other than the fact that I just like how that's the way I do it. So. Uh, no secret, really. Uh, again, like I said before, uh, Steve. I grew up watching and really liking Steve Eiserman. Um, but other than that, again, there's no weird story behind it. Just that I like the number. So, what are we doing today? Um, hopefully, playing another sport or something. So, um, you know, I've always always played sports. Um, so I don't know, maybe a lawyer or something. Don't mind our don't mind a good argument.